Welcome to this video! A new day, a new vlog from your boy. So I want to start this video off by unboxing a box that I have right here. And it's a really heavy box. Show you what I ordered. And I have here three other things that I'm going to show you in a second. But first... Get my knife out and let's do it. Here we go. Oh yeah, amazing package. Full. Oh, right there, a lot of stuff. And a massive shout out to the link. Their company is just amazing. You always get a nice message with your personal writing name on there. Hey Darko, just lean back and enjoy your order. Follow them on Instagram at the lean shop. Yo, this is what I ordered. I ordered 26 pieces. Oh my god. Energy drinks for sure. Woo! Here we go. That's one, and that's the other one. And that's basically it. So in total, I ordered like 21 cans of energy drinks and a couple other stuff. So yeah, I ordered zero monsters right here. I ordered four of each flavor. So in stores, we do have these orange one, I thought, let's just order them. But we don't have these green ones and the blue ones in the store. So I ordered four green ones, four blue ones, four orange ones, one 3D purple, one 3D white. Then I ordered two of the bang rainbow unicorn and this is zero sugar I ordered two let's see C4 energy drinks which I've never seen and I'm really excited to try uh, two again from bang bangster berry flavor and I ordered one from bang pina colada again zero calorie sugar free I ordered two of their best sauce ever this teriyaki sauce this is my favorite sauce all time no joke, this teriyaki is just 10 out of 10. And I ordered a couple protein snacks, so two protein bars, my two favorite protein bars. In the whole wide world, the grenade, peanut, salty, and the trust crunch caramel. Salted caramel peanut. And I ordered a protein cookie bag, Lenny and Larry's, just to try out. So yeah, guys, these are the things I ordered. And I also ordered a couple more protein bars, barbell protein bars, and a body and fit protein bar from a different company body and fit because they were on sale and I had to buy protein there all right let's start with the weight let's see where we are at and yes I broke the 95 kg barrier 94.7 the first time I'm below 95 kg this is my lowest weight lost 9 kg in total and here is my physique oh my god the lighting Ah, uh, the lighting is so bad in the mornings, but this is my physique at 95 kg exactly. This is my morning shape. Being on really low carbs for the last week. The legs poses, the side, the back. You can see my back is getting leaner. The love handles are really getting thinner and thinner. And I can just notice. I can even pinch my lower back, which is a really good sign. Let's do some poses. Back pose. Really awesome and today guys today I will have a refeed and I will show you my physique at night which I normally don't do but I will show you it today just to show you how I look when I'm filled up. Really happy with the cup with how it's going. I can't complain. Let's grab a coffee. And just to show you, yes, I'm still having my supplements. So I'm having my half of a lemon of the day and today I kind of want a whole lemon so there we go squeeze it in juice of a whole lemon sodium ascorbate one teaspoon two tablets of nuts some water and there we go cheers so also for the people that ask me which kind of coffee i use or drink every morning it's this simple dutch coffee senseo so it's basically these small pads which you put in the machine you close it up grab a mug and just put the mug there press play and the coffee comes out pure black coffee comes out all right 
It's morning time. Sunday, April 26, 9.30 in the morning. And yes, that's my girlfriend, me, eating donuts. So yeah, having my coffee in the morning. And this is like exactly 10 weeks in the cup. And I lost about 9 kg of body weight. I started this cut at 103.8, now 94.7, which is amazing. So I should have done a show 17th of May, which is in like two weeks from now. Three weeks from now almost, everything is like cancelled. And my prep as well, almost like a month ago, I said to myself and my coach that I'm just not gonna prep. And yes, I'm still working with my coach. I paid him and then we are still continuing with this call. As you can see, just drinking plain black coffee. And the basic plan for after that is just to maintain. Guys, next cut, next prep, I just want to start at this point where I'm at now. So I don't need to struggle that much. I know I can do it, but I just want to do it once when I'm already lean. So I want to maintain a lean physique and start my prep on a good start. Still feeling awesome. The sun is out. It's Sunday. It's a sunny day. You can hear the birds. Just amazing. I'm gonna enjoy this coffee. Think this is gonna be a high day, high carb day. No cheat day, I'm still not sure on that. Might have the ice cream, I don't know. I'm still texting with my coach right now. I just sent him my weight and my pictures just to see what he has to say. I'm gonna enjoy this coffee and catch up with you. Wait a second. All right, before I have my meal, I will try out a energy drink. Guys, I've got a ton of energy drinks. As you saw this morning, I did unbox this package that I got from the Lean Company. Or not got, I bought it. I ordered a lot of different flavored energy drinks. But I didn't order it for myself. I did order a couple variety and I added a couple more because I'm gonna give this to the guy where I'm training it. So I'm training at a friend's place in his garage. He has his own gym. And I know he drinks energy drinks. And I bought him different flavored monsters. I know he drinks monsters, but I all ordered myself different energy drinks just to try out. So today I kind of want to try out this Bang Rainbow Unicorn. This just sounds delicious. But before I try it, I do want to drink it cold. So I'm going to put it in the freezer for 10, 20 minutes before I make my breakfast. Guys. I'm a real basic guy. Try out this really cheap basmati rice. See if there is a difference with expensive and cheap rice. 300 grams of rice in the pan. 301. Add some water to it. And go ahead and boil it. There we go. And like I said, today I'm going to have as well with the rice 100 grams of oatmeal. Exactly 100 grams of oatmeal. Add some water. Microwave it. Here we go, thick oatmeal, and to my oatmeal, one scoop of this chocolate peanut butter protein, just there, and just mix this in. There we go, just perfect protein. And because I have four bananas, I will add one. Just dice it up and add it on top. Perfect as this, a little bit of nutmeg and cinnamon. I just would like to sprinkle cinnamon on top, but just a little bit of nutmeg. And today is a higher day and I also got a little bit more fat. So I'll have whole earth smooth peanut butter. So I'll add one tablespoon. Let's do it. Let's do a little bit more right there. Oh yeah. Just a lovely breakfast now 11 30. I will go to the gym and show you that I think around 1 o'clock a little bit later than normal Chocolate peanut butter protein banana and the cinnamon nutmeg and peanut butter oatmeal banana a little bit of cinnamon Here we go mm. Oh, yeah, Ooh. Ooh, the cinnamon is strong with the nutmeg banana Mm. It is almost spring. This is a winter dish, but I can eat this every single day. I don't know the calories of this. I just have 300 grams of rice, 100 grams of oatmeal, 4 bananas, and that's it. So this is the first meal. It is 11.30. I'm checking with you in just a minute. Here we go. The oatmeal is done, and I totally forgot about my energy drink. It's almost frozen. So let's go. Oh, it smells it smells so good. Let's try it out. Wow. Wow. No calories at all. I'm really questioning that. Because it's amazing. It reminds me of some kind of candy I had in the past. Or a candy that still exists. 
Mmm. A really familiar taste. Sour warm candy. It's called, I think, truly sour warm. It reminds me of that. Ah, oh, this one is good. I'm gonna say it. Bangtastic. <laughs> To show you the time, it's almost 1 o'clock, I will go to the gym at like 2 o'clock, so I will probably see you there. Alright, I'm heading to the gym now, bringing this as a gift for the friend, and after my gym workout, I will have one banana and one scoop of protein. So as you saw this morning, I ordered this package right there, and I ordered another one with, with this protein from BSN Milk chocolate it is a two kilogram jar which was only 25 euros that's why i ordered it but i'm gonna say this is not my favorite one the taste is really bland really boring so i have one scoop there and this will be after the gym one banana one scoop of protein here we go yeah yeah oh good good there's a trimmer down at the trainer, I met it. Nice bike though. done with the gym so now we'll have the shake and the banana after the gym and yeah as you saw I gave the monsters to the friend and that was my friend he has an awesome motor as well and I just want if you're watching this I want to thank you for letting me train there by giving you the monsters so yeah yeah I will have the protein shake so don't spill fuel me up after the gym some protein a banana right here oh I'm pretty hungry not gonna not gonna lie so here we go banana mmm Mmm, sure guys. Mmm. So this is the with the BSN milk chocolate protein. And I'm not gonna lie, it's not the best protein. It doesn't really mix mix that well and it's not that sweet. It, it, this is really really plain, not the best protein. So now I'm really quickly gonna enjoy this while I'm driving home. And today is just so nice, such a nice weather. It's like 20 degrees almost. So we're gonna enjoy this delicious sweet banana. Mmm, ASMR, ASMR. Mm -mm -mm. It's now four o'clock. I just got home, preheated the oven. I am boiling some broccoli right here. My rice is already done and I will cut up some vegetables and have a little bit of chicken. Then just put it in the oven and it's done in 20 minutes. And here we are. It is now 
almost five o'clock and this is my post-workout meal so i've got everything cooked and ready i've got half of the rice that i use i've got the vegetables broccoli there i've got chicken and half of an avocado teriyaki from the lean and i'm just gonna sprinkle it all over and like so guys this sauce no joke the teriyaki with the chicken and the rice well, let me get a bit of the rice right here This sauce, when it hits your tongue, you just taste it. Mm. That is so damn good. No joke. This teriyaki sauce is fire. Broccoli mm. should have been three weeks out from my competition. And I would be so lean if I continued this prep. But yeah, I can't complain. I'm still lean. You can see the muscles, the fibers, the veins are coming out. For sure, my muscle and my skin is getting thinner and thinner, which is a good thing. I hope after three weeks, I can hit the 92 kilogram. If I can, that would be amazing. And then go up to 95 and just maintain 95 kilograms. Because I'm now 95. I have three more weeks, so I can lose a lot in the three weeks. Or at least I, I will lose a couple kilograms in this two, three weeks. Mm. And the vegetables that I put in the oven, you can see the onion, all caramelized, mm. sweet, delicious. So yeah guys, going to enjoy this meal, post-workout meal, I'll have the same exact meal, but without the chicken, I will add tuna at around 6, 7 o'clock, and then have my last two bananas and shakes. Almost 8 o'clock at night, I'm gonna have my last big meal of the day again rice vegetables a little bit of chicken there and i'm gonna have one can of tuna i've got here three whole eggs for the fats also to the side i've got my low fat sambal cheese and i will have my teriyak my tuna on there and you guys ask me how do i boil my egg and this is why you guys ask me that Ooh, look at that yolk it's not too runny it's just Perfect. I'm not really counting. I'm just gonna add one heaping scoop of this cheese on there. Let it melt my teriyaki on there. A simple big ass meal mm. with a perfect egg right there for the fat. Got protein, mostly carbs, vegetables to the side. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Just loving this. Loving dry carbs. Mm. Chicken. Perfect meal. So yeah, gonna eat this now. Let's just do a time lapse, show. Here we go, the meal is done. I've just got one whole egg right there left. And what I'm going to do, just a little bit of the teriyaki on there. And just like that, pop the whole egg in my mouth. That yolk. Mm -mm -mm. The whole meal is gone. It's now 8 12 at night. <sighs> also, grab some water here. <sighs> that was pretty satisfying. Big meal. 9 30. I will have my last meal of the day, which will be those two bananas. And I think I'm gonna do some quark instead of protein shakes. Alright, it is getting pretty late at night. I am going to end my video and. So, mama, <laughs> my mama's doing some exercise. I'm gonna end my video with something sweet, and I'm not gonna have two shakes that I wanted, that I planned. I'm gonna have this whole container of quark and my two bananas that I have left over. So, this is the thing I should have had two shakes to end the video, but. I'm really craving sweets. I crave sweets so bad now. I'm not gonna lie, I did have a little bit of chocolate because I'm not taking it that serious and this is the first time in the week that I'm kind of cheating. I'm gonna have this as my cheat of the night of the week. It has carbs in it, so I will be above 400 grams of carbs of the day. I will be above 500 grams, including the chocolate I had there. So yeah, I will have this whole container. There we go. Two bananas on top of this quark. Mix in the banana like so, and this will be my dessert. Here we go, end of the night, end of the day. I'm gonna enjoy this quark ball with my good mate Teddy Radia. So, yeah, guys, I did kind of cheat on the diet, I should have done it clean today. But it's so hard, so hard when you ha don't really have a goal. Like, well, if I was prepping, I would be so motivated. But now I just don't have a goal. I really want to do it loosely. So, I'm having this quark ball. 
mm, two bananas so for the whole day I will be above the calories I need it and yes like I said I did have a bit of chocolate today just like a square or a row of chocolate strawberry cheesecake of the Milka oh I had to just grab a bite of the chocolate because it's my weekend first day of the week and I kind of wanted to have something so yeah I'm gonna have this see this as my cheat of the week maybe next week I will be at 93 kilograms 92 and I might even cheat big again the whole day and I think I will weigh in heavier tomorrow but yeah guys we'll check in with you later on night to show you my physique all right here we go it's pretty late it's now almost 11 o'clock at night show you my physique especially my upper body you can see my belly kind of bloated but this is how I look with all the carbs from today this is my physique at night with all the food yeah I feel pretty hard I feel the muscles are hard right now and you can definitely see that you can definitely see that my waist it's somewhat thick up there's the veins popping you will see my back also I also trained my back but guys this is my strongest part <laughs> right here my back right here oh yeah it was a good day not a crazy day like my last cheat day kind of curious for tomorrow because I do think I will weigh in somewhat higher <laughs> darko 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 yeah I f***ed up. I f***ed up big times. Let's see the weight. It's okay. It's okay. 96.3 kilograms. The day after the clean refeed. That means I've gained 1.6 kg. Ah, to show you the time. It's pretty late. It's now almost 11 o'clock in the morning. Monday. And yeah, guys. <laughs> I f***ed up. And I just want to be open and real with you all. I up and I ate this whole pint of Hagen Dust peanut butter ice cream. Yes, I did it. I did it. I couldn't resist it and I did eat this whole pint of ice cream and a little bit more. Not gonna lie, I added some peanut butter and some cookie butter spread on there. Even after the rice, after the bananas, the quark, I was still hungry. I was craving sweets and like I said, I did have that piece of chocolate which I, sh which I shouldn't have eaten and because of that I crave sweets more and more so that's why I say don't eat crappy food because you will crave more coach said just let's not cheat this weekend and yeah it's fucked up but as you can see I gained only 1.6 kilograms which I'm freaking stoked about and also with my quark I added a little bit of cookie butter <gasps> uh, yeah I didn't want to film it because I thought I'm not gonna eat the ice cream just a little bit of cookie butter wouldn't hurt it a little bit of chocolate that's why I told you it but then yeah when I ate this, I had to share it. How I look with 400 grams or 500 grams of carbs and the cheat. So this is the day after cheating and having the stuff, which is okay. Like, I don't feel really bloated. I feel pretty good. This is my physique back pose. I do feel like I'm holding a little bit of water. Feels a little bit thicker than yesterday, but I feel filled up. I feel hard for sure. Some muscles when I squeeze them. Just good, amazing, some poses, yeah. Still see the abs, I'm not holding that much water. Because I'm not working, I want to try and film this whole week. I want to film this experience with you, how I'm going to handle this benching moment, this cheat day, what I've done, and how I'm going to recover from it. Do you think it's a good idea? Tell them, yes, it's a great idea, yay! Let's do it guys. So I'm gonna film every single day this week. It is Monday today. I'm gonna to end this video and I'm gonna start a new video. I'm gonna do it tomorrow, the day after that, till Sunday. Hopefully Sunday I can cheat again. And the plan for now is, and you will see it throughout the whole week, is to lose the weight and to get back on track. That is my main focus and that's what I always say. When you have a binge moment, when you have a cheat day, when you mess up, just get back on track. Forget everything and get back on track. Hopefully my coach won't see this video. <laughs> So if you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button so I know you appreciate and like the effort I'm putting in my videos. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe to my YouTube channel at Live Life right there. Follow me on Instagram at Darkoponit. You can see my daily stuff, what I'm doing. And if you want to be the first in these videos, turn on your notification bell right there. And you will be notified when my videos are. And guys, I hope you have a great day, great night.
whatever it is in life, do what you want. Do it now. I dare you live life. Peace.